Lights, camera, auction. Yes, the auction is done and dusted, and the players have gone under the hammer. There have been some serious surprises in this auction. My favorite moment in this auction is not Deepak Sir going for 14 crores and not Ishan Kishan going for 15 and out crores. It is on the last hour of the day two in this auction, Hugh Edmeads, the auctioneer, after unfortunately what he had on the previous day, day one of the auction, coming back and just taking the dyers for the continuation of the last hour of the auction. Charu Sharma stepping in at a moment's notice and what a fantastic job he did over these two days. I think from the next time on, all of you should do the show in Bangalore so that there is a good competition and we can do an auction for the auctioneer <laughs> if there is another opportunity to, for that to happen. But, you know, Charu is, is, is a gem and uh, as I said, there is a, there's an IPL parallel to what Charu did uh, at, at the auction, right? Um, he was the Chris Gale who was flown in as a super sub, went on to score 175 in that innings. Yeah. And, you know, got the man of the match, man of the series and whatever that he did in that year. I yeah. think that's Charu for you for, uh, for, for, for the IPL auction. Of course, big kudos to Mr. Charu Sharma. Let me talk about the pride of 2022. Yes, I'm talking about the Chennai Super Kings. Chennai Super Kings have thrown in some big surprises. And I predicted in the last video that Devin Conway will be bought by Chennai Super Kings. And yes, they have bought him. Bought him for a brace price of about 2 crores. Let me talk about some interesting names. By the way, Chennai Super Kings have brought back their core players in Ambati Raidu, Dwayne Bravo, so on and so forth. And of course, they have also brought some uh, net bowlers who are part of the group of Chennai Super Kings last year and have promoted them by taking them into the team with the likes of Prashant Solanki, Mukesh Traudri, so on and so forth. So let me talk about let me talk about the eight foreigners in the Chennai Super Kings squad. Number one, Moin Ali, he was already retained. Number two, Dwayne Bravo, the legend in T20 cricket, who recently announced his retirement in the T20 International. Next in line, in when it comes to foreigners, is the mystery spinner from Sri Lanka, Mahesh Tikshana. I feel that was a very good pick and a bargain pick for just 75 lakhs. He is worth gold. Next in line is the most interesting batter from South Africa and gone on to play for New Zealand. Devin Conway, then the man from South Africa, Dwayne Pretorius, who has the long, long hands to hit those huge sixes and has the ability to bowl in the depth. Mitchell Sandner, they have brought back in this team from last year too. Adam Mill, who was part of the Mumbai Indians, have brought back, have been bought by the Chennai Super Kings. So, now there's one interesting pick here. The last foreigner in line, Chris Jordan. He has been one of the mainstays in T20 international cricket when it comes to England. But when it comes to IPL, he has not done his level best. So, I hope under MSD's captaincy, he goes wonder. Wonders. So, let me talk about the new picks when it comes to Indian internationals. So, Deepak Chakar has been brought by the Chennai Super Kings for a whooping 14.25 crores. 14 crores. Yes, he is a very good asset for the team with the new ball and can hit those long sixes in the death overs too. So, Tushar Deshpande is another pick by the Chennai Super Kings, a fast bowler who was part of the net, bo net bowlers last year. So, Simarjit Singh, I want to talk about this man. He is a man who was brought by the Mumbai Indians last year as a replacement for Arjun Tendulkar and he has a very good in-swing, out-swing and can bowl at 140 clicks. Simarjit Singh, Delhi Capitals are into a net bowler and the Southern talent, sir. Nasolra, our Edgartica, Ulo Tripanang, even Capitals Clean, Arape, there was talk around the camp that even a Matakini Arbola are injured on a replacement in Labin and a talk of each. 
வெரி ஷார்ப் வெரி ஸ்லிப்பரி என்ன சொல்றது ஈ கேன் கிராங்க் இட் அப் ஒரு ஒன் ஃபார்ட்டி ஒன் ஃபார்ட்டி ஃபைவ் போடக்கூடிய கேப்பபிலிட்டி அவருக்கு இருக்கு அது ஒரு பயங்கரமான பிக் நான் ஃபீல் பண்ணேன் ஏன்னா எஸ்பெஷலி அந்த டைம்ல ஃபாஸ்ட் பூலர் தேடிட்டு இருக்கும் போது ஜெயில உணர்ட்டுக்கு போவாங்கன்னு ஹண்ட்ரட் பர்சன்ட் தெரியும் பட் அவர் கடைக்கலன்னு ஒண்ணு இந்த மாதிரி மேக்அப் பண்ணி அந்த ஹங்கர் கேக்கரி எடுத்தது ஒரு குவாலிட்டி மூவ் நான் this team has a mix of youth and experience and this can help too i also forgot to tell about one name robin uttappa he was a bargain pick for just two crores if i am not wrong he was part of the chennai super kings last year who was a superstar in the semi final and the finals too so under msd's captaincy players punch above their weights and of course we can also predict this team who has who have who have not has who ha, uh, not has some big superstars but can uh, but can do wonders for the team so shivam dubey is another one all rounder who has the capability with the bat and all the ball and also with the ball he has to invent some new things in his career and there is there is no better man than ms dhoni to just guide him to make it to the indian 11 in the future so last but not the least going away from the ipl auctions i am going to talk about the india a west indies t20 international series 2-0 done and dusted of the uh, from the three match t20 internationals against the west indies they were dominant and just were just outplayed west indies were outplayed by the indians and of course Virat Kohli and Rishabh Pant have been um, consistent performers and when it comes to Virat Kohli we are we all have been talking about the 71st 100 but Virat Kohli's and numbers don't go well together so let's put that to rest let's put that to bed and may Virat Kohli score this score some many runs in his rest of his career and Virat Kohli and Rishabh Pant have been released from the bio bubble and will not be taking part in the 3020 international yes that's the hot news for the when it comes to the 3020 international i believe shreyas ayer shardul thakur kuldeep yadav and rudraj gaikwad will come in the level and just get the chances that is from this video we'll catch you also in the next episode until then bye bye halamte habibu halamte habibu vandale